Women who have a problem with biological men going into their spaces have been attacked during a protest which was disrupted by trans rights activists. So yesterday in Manchester, the gender critical activist Posey Parker or Kelly J. Keane talked in Manchester along with other women with the same opinions. These opinions can be summarised as sex not gender, as in keep biological men out of women's spaces like bathrooms, prisons. Not really a crazy idea, is it? <laughs> However, of course, this was met with counter-protest by so-called trans rights activists. Side of history! We're on the right side of history! Some of which turned up in balaclavas and didn't seem to want to speak to anyone. I did come for the statue, but if you want to have a discussion, I'm open to it. No? Okay. Sorry, wh why are you blocking me from the statue? Hello, let's ask you a question. Qu watch your face. They surrounded the suffragette statue in Manchester where Posey Parker's demonstration originally was going to be. And one of these people in balaclavas tried to attack a woman with a suffragette flag. <laughs> This led to the hashtag let women speak trend on Twitter and I'm glad trans rights activists are finally being exposed to the people they are. So how did the left respond? How did, for example, Owen Jones respond to this situation? Perhaps a comment on how a woman was attacked during this protest. No, he uses it to point score how apparently gender critical women silence those with differing views. He tweeted, anti-trans activists always claim that women are being silenced, yet monster and try and silence any woman who supports trans rights. Here's an example of it in a video form. Trans women are women! Trans women are women! Trans women! If that's your main focus where a woman was attacked, Get your priorities right. They gave this woman the mic, they allowed her to speak. In comparison to the other woman who got attacked for just trying to hold a suffragette flag next to the statue. And if this was the other way around, the left will be claiming that turfs are trying to intimidate them. It's ridiculous. But I'm glad these people are being exposed for how they truly are. They don't care about women. They don't care about people's safety. They just care about enforcing their radical left agenda. I'm Jess Gill, this is Reason. Please like, comment and subscribe. Goodbye.